I M I R T So M R T, is that correct? N I N How do you say that? M R T who? Um, D D 2022? Well, just 2022. <laughs> so, how do we say, and look over here, I am the 2022 Fargo Public Schools. <laughs> Sage, what was it like when Grandma was coming to pick you up today? 
Okay, Dad picked you up and you're like, all right, what's going on? <laughs> we're going to go to Mom's school and we're going to give her an award. So if you'd introduce your, um, who that's here? Well, this is a big surprise. We was not expecting the applicant to go this way at all. But I guess uh, David is pretty sneaky about making sure I was part of this gig. <laughs> um, but I'm so thankful to the leadership that David and Jim has shown me and all the teachers that I work with. It's because I am meeting people who share similar passions as I do that I'm able to do this work. And it's easier to do this work with them. Um, and it would not have been without the support of my family. Um, I don't know if everybody knows, but my parents are in Nepal, but these are the families that I have here who have been crucial to any of the successes that I've had throughout my whole time in Fargo. So that's a safe spare Tom. And that's uh, not Maya that I'm always asking her for a lot of wisdom and information on what life's like here versus how it was in Bhutan and Nepal. And then that's Taylor, <laughs> my nanny turned into a lifelong sister. <laughs> and then my uh, grandma Jean, and uh, that's Carrie. Um, we, Sage has been lucky enough to have quite a few grandmas around town. And grandma's kind of sprinkled everywhere. And then my dad, <laughs> my dad here it is. And it's this family who had kind of helped me be able to do what I'm passionate about. And as of right now, it's working to help our male families. Um, and yeah, thank you everyone for being here.